Good evening. So, I haven't done a video all day today because, well, I've been busy. And tomorrow we're getting our dumpster, so I'm probably going to be busy all weekend as well. Which means I still have to go inside and I need to fold laundry more. <laughs> I have towels and washcloths to put away. I put away most of all the clothes. I haven't really been on here today. Um, I did a video. I'm going to be honest with you. I can't show it. <laughs> unless my husband edits it or something. And I'm not really too fond of the editing. But I was leaning over. And I had a tank top on. So I decided not to upload it. And it kind of sucks too. Because I was doing the... Um, <laughs> I was doing the uh, potatoes. So I had the tripod out here and all that fun jazz. So you just kind of miss me planting some hills. Um, they're just loose. So. That's it. And then I did tinkered and did some stuff between outside and inside and it's just a lot. There's a lot of yard cleanup still. Um, I know a lot of you are asking about what to do next and um, at this point we're still working on getting that solar power and we're still working on keeping up on the whole food and water thing and it's an ongoing thing um, we, we do prep hard and it seems like life takes it away and we run out of stuff and if something were to happen today We'd be all right, but we wouldn't have everything that we needed and wanted. So, there's a, uh, your biggest prep would probably be, obviously, water and food and some supplies. Your biggest prep, in my heart, if the SHTF would really happen, would be to prep yourself spiritually. Yep. So, um, cause it says, God says, the Holy Spirit will be lifted with the rapture. And when God lifts his Holy Spirit from the earth, from people and from the earth just hell's gonna break loose you don't want to be here for that so on that note um we have a dumpster coming tomorrow to take care of all that junk that's in the uh what do you call it The garage, but this is, I don't know, like a lean-to off the garage. So that's the garage. And then there's this part off the garage. The back of that is full of junk. Yeah, full of junk. <laughs> we got old fence here. No fence posts. A bunch of stuff on top of the garage that we have to take the roof rake and get rid of that. Yeah, so we have a lot to get rid of. And then of course there's always the, um, what do you call it? So after we do this and the garage, if we have enough room, 
and the uh, what's it called? Basement. <laughs> Losing my words today. It's getting late. I've had enough, I think. Um, there we go. <laughs> so yeah, maybe we can clean out some of the basement, but I, I told my husband to keep it for the five, but I don't think he wants to do that. So I guess we're just gonna keep it for the weekend. This tree has to go. And I don't really want it to. I like the bottom of it. it just feels good. So I'm thinking, asking my husband, or asking a friend of mine to get rid of those limbs there. These ones right here. And I think that should be good. And a couple over there. But other than that, this big one needs to go. See that one right there? It goes right here. That one definitely needs to go. And then these trees have to get limbed. And I think if we limb those, it would be better. So anyway, I'm gonna go back inside and I'm sorry I haven't uploaded a video and I'm sorry about my video with too much into the out while I, I mean everything was all up and then I don't know I got leaning over and doing the potato hills and my shirt might have been too big I don't know but I'm not I'm not uploading that so well, I'm getting text bombed by my daughter and others <laughs> so I'm going to let you guys go <clears throat> and I'm gonna go back up to the house and uh, I'm hoping to catch up on some of y'all's videos. I won't get to everyone. It's just a busy time of year. Later. God bless.